Hey, single Capricorns, who's coming in for you? Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, welcome back to the channel, you guys. Thank you for tuning in. Singles, Capricorn singles, who's coming in? New love interest, new date, who's coming in for you? For Capricorn singles, who's coming in? Neptune, Pisces energy, Virgo energy, and we have Cancer. Okay. So this person, we have two water sign energies here. Pisces, Neptune rules Pisces, and Cancer is here. So this could be a very sweet person, very emotional person. This could be a person who understands you, understands emotions, understands where you're coming from. The energy of Virgo, I feel very friendly. I, I'm just feeling this friendly energy. So this could be a friend. This could be someone who you know as a friend or someone in your friendship circle, a friend of a friend as well. We do have Jupiter at the bottom of the deck, the energy of Sagittarius. Could be a very fun, spontaneous person, someone who does not like to be bored, I'm feeling. This is also the type of person who would like give you the shirt off their back. <clears throat> Yeah, like if you needed anything, this person would definitely be there for you. Someone who believes in loyalty. Who is this person coming in for single Capricorn? Who is this person? Could be an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. The King of Wands is here. The World card. <clears throat> Whoa. Some of you could have closed out a cycle, possibly with a uh, fire sign. You, Capricorn, there you are. Yeah, some of you could have just ended something. Yeah, being distant. <clears throat> Maybe you were with someone who was uh, very passionate as well. Maybe you had a very passionate connection with someone. You could be closing out that cycle now. And newly single for some of you. Show me what's going on. Single Capricorns. Justice is here, Libra's energy with the lovers, Gemini's here, air sign energy coming through. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, some of you, let me say this, some of you could have recently went through a divorce or separation. I'm getting this for a lot of the signs. It seems like a lot of people are breaking up and going through divorces or just breaking up with people in general. So someone could have went through something here a divorce, a separation. I got this for Leo as well. You could be dealing with the Leo again of a fire sign energy. And I feel like here they're very focused on you. You could be focused on someone brand new as well. Capricorn singles, put the characters where they go. Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, who's coming in? Show me this person. Eight of Wands. For some of you, someone at a distance, or you could be connecting with this person through like phone calls, text messages. They could need to travel to see you. King of Cups. It could be a, a water sign. I already mentioned Pisces and Cancer. Knight of Wands. The Harfont. Whoa, this could move very fast into a committed relationship. The energy of Taurus with the Harfont. Knight of Wands, fast-moving energy, moving into a solid, committed relationship. You could even get married to this person. Show me this King of Cups energy. Ten of Wands. The Empress, whoa. Someone who's willing to put in the work for you, work hard for you. Yeah. Someone is willing to even fight for you, I feel. Judgment is here. With the hermit. Okay. <clears throat> Some of you could have a Virgo coming in. If this is an earth sign, it could be a Virgo. Emperor is here as well. This could represent an age gap. Virgo and Aries energy coming through. For some of you, this could be someone who's a bit older. Emperor and Empress is here. Someone is ready for a relationship, a commitment. I feel like after you have closed out a cycle with someone, some of you may have been single for a while. And now it's like you're coming into, 
something that could be pretty solid, okay, and pretty serious here. But I feel like this could be someone at a distance. I'm getting like long distance connection. Whoa, what fell out? Ace of Wands, okay. Nine of Swords, whoa. This person is wanting to connect, honey. Do you hear me? They want to connect. Definitely feeling the sexual chemistry between the, the two of you. I almost said sexual tension. So this person, they could be ready to sleep with you, make love to you. This person is ready to connect on that level with you. Yeah. What does this person want to say? Because Emperor and Empress is here. So this is like a power couple. You may have a power couple energy coming in. Okay. This person is on your level. What does this person want to say? Ten of Cups. Wow. The Tower. Kaboom. Five of Wands. Like I said, someone went through like a divorce or someone went through some type of breakup. And that has been difficult. Now, there could be some jealousy, Capricorn singles. If you're moving on from one person and going to the new person, someone, there could be jealousy. Yes, with the five of wands, someone, you could have had a difficult breakup with someone. Okay? It, there could have been like fighting, arguing. <sighs> Whoa, what was that? And, oh, Okay. Seven of Swords with the Ace of Cups. You may have to sneak away. Okay, if if you're dating someone new or you're interested in getting to know someone new, say you're talking to someone, you may have to do it secretly. You may not be able to broadcast it yet. You may not be able to tell everyone about the new person, Ace of Cups. Seven of Swords, you may have to keep it to yourself. Y'all may have to like kind of date on the low. Is what I'm feeling. Because you may have some jealous people. It could be family as well. People who don't have good things to say. Show me single Capricorn's energy toward this person. Six of Pentacles. Four of Cups. Two of Cups. Yeah. And the offer is there. It may be with someone that... You may have thought that things weren't going to work out with this new person. And then it's like, no, I'm going to make things work. Four of cups, two of cups. You want to give an offer to someone. I see you extending this offer. You want to have this with this person, this two of cups. You feel like this is your person. Show me single Capricorn's energy. Page of cups. King of pentacles. Nine of Cups. Okay, okay. And the Moon. <laughs> Some of you have... It's like you have this strong desire to be with this person, but you could be keeping it to yourself. So you are already in that Seven of Swords energy that I was just talking about. Some of you, you haven't mentioned to anyone how you feel about this person. You're kind of keeping it a secret. Mmm... What is this person's intentions with single Capricorns? What are their intentions? Page of Wands. Six of Cups. They want to flirt. They want to talk. They want to date. Seven of Cups with the Death card. They're willing to put away their other options. Putting an ending to their options. They're also tired of fantasizing about you. They want to put an end to that too. This person is tired of fantasizing. They want to get it started with you. It's like wanting to be with you in the flesh, in person. Page of Wands with the Six of Cups. It's like telling you like they have a crush on you. They've always liked you. This person has always liked you. They've always wanted to be with you. And it's like they're tired. I feel that energy here in Seven of Cups with the Death card. Putting an end to fantasizing. And it's like putting an end to the other options as well. They don't want to just dream about you. Like this person actually wants to date you. Anything else that single Capricorn should know? We have three of pentacles with the star. Yeah, they can't wait to date. 
It's like meeting up, feeling this amazing spark with you. You are their wish. You, Capricorn, Queen of Pentacles, you're their wish. Queen of Swords, they could really admire you a lot. This person loves everything about you. Like they love like how you dress. They love how you carry yourself. This person also thinks you're very smart. Like I don't I don't know if you've like spoken with this person much or had many conversations. They may like how you talk or how you think with the energy of the Queen of Swords. They've been watching you. Yeah, Page of Swords, spying, watching. But this is getting difficult for them to keep watching. They could be a Leo with the strength card. Again, it's getting difficult to keep watching you or to keep having like these passive little conversations with you or, you know, small talk. Like this person wants something more real with you. Page of Pentacles is here. Again, there could be an age gap for some of you. They could come off <laughs> as a bit shy here. Page of Pentacles. High Priestess. They feel such a deep connection here. Ten of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Yeah. This is a person, single Capricorns, that you should really give a chance. Just saying. You should give this person a chance. Whoever they are. <clears throat> Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit. Make the effort and give this person a chance. Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit. Insight or advice. What's going on? Gold Digger. You got this before. I remember. They want your money being used. You could have ended a cycle with a gold digger. I was getting a fire sign energy at the beginning. Someone else interested in someone else. This person could have cheated. Okay, if you were with someone else, you were married to someone else. Someone could have cheated. They could have involved a third party. Someone could have used you for your money as well. For some of you, this person was using your money to pay for somebody else. I'm going to just put it out there. Gold digger and someone else. Someone could have been using the money that you helped them with. And they were paying for dates with other people with that money. Very specific energy. Take it as it resonates. That's not for everyone. Give me some insight. Health. This could have affected your health. You could have gone through a lot. Yeah, challenges. Some of you went through some type of health challenge with this person. You could have had to, you know, maybe some of you could have had to go to the hospital, okay? This could have been a very abusive situation with this person. Mentally abusive, physically, verbally abusive. I'm getting that as well. Wow. This could have affected you, maybe have sent you even into depression for some of you. You may have had to, like, seek help. Anything else? Divorce. Yeah, I'm I'm telling you, I was feeling this in the very beginning, Capricorn. Some of you have gone through a divorce. For others of you, it just says experiencing a breakup. I'm telling you, you went through something where you had to close out a cycle with another person and there could have been cheating involved. There could have been all kinds of things going on with this person. Mmm. Stealing money? I feel like someone stole money. And you may have found that out. I feel like this is past inner energy, not something that could be happening right now. It could be, but I'm feeling more so past. Like you found out that this person was taking money from you and giving it to someone else. Oh my gosh. This has left both of you heartbroken. Look, I see the two hearts and they may have thought they were getting over on you but karma may have hit this person and this situation left both of you heartbroken but i see you moving on this feels more so like past energy okay something that already happened okay wow what does this new person want to say to single capricorn this new person who's watching, who's spying. What does this person want to say? Because I feel like they really admire you. It feels like a very sweet person, sweet energy. 
words of affirmation. So this person, your words may carry weight with them. What you say really means a lot to them. Okay, words of affirmation. A thousand times yes. They don't care about your situation, what you've been through. This person is like, I will say yes to you a thousand times. Dance with me forever. They could be a dancer. They could love to dance. Okay, they could love your moves, love how you dance. You are so very special to me. That's a sweet energy that I'm feeling like this person would be willing to do what it takes to be with you because you are so special to them and they want to show you how special you are. And one more, they feel like the two of you are a perfect match. Wow. Alrighty, Capricorn singles, that is your energy for this week. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Sophia Monetero. I look forward to hearing from you. Take care. Bye.